Hey Chin Chow Man 1 here and my dad just got back from a fishing trip and he stopped by a couple of antique stores and stuff like that, flea markets and he brought back a couple of things. Uh, he got me some bottles, I didn't look at them yet so I'm just gonna unwrap everything live on camera. But uh, first off, he found a 64 nickel that looks to be silver, this old medic alert tag. And uh, he got three pairs of earrings, I don't know if they're gold or not, for uh, 10 cents a pair. And I think they're gold plated or whatever. But I'm more interested in the bottles, so let's get started. Coffee. First up. Pretty big. A Continental General American Army Wheaton, New Jersey Washington Bitters Reproduction Flask or Bottle. Just pretty cool. This little jug for 50 cents with a picture on it. It's new, but it's nice. And this is an insulator. Let me just turn it off that. Sorry about that noise when I was watching TV in the background. Oh, sick. It's a carnival glass insulator. Pyrex. TM Reg US Pat Off, made in USA. Now that's that's amazing. You have to thank him a lot for that because that's pretty rare. Now on to the next stuff. Let's get this bag open here. Number one. The cork top Atwood's John Spinners. Sweet. That's good. Next. Eighteen seventy nine Czechoslovakia Santa figure. Eighteen ninety seven. Ten cents, Jesus. Wow. So I have taught my dad well to look for old stuff. Shiloh's Consumption Cure. Now this is a heroin bottle. Leroy, New York, SC Wells. These are pretty rare. I've been looking for one for a while now because I have like an elixir of opium and uh, a couple of other ones. Let's see what this is. A shot glass. New York State Department of Health. Hold. Now that's that's awesome. And last but not least, Chamberlain's Pain Balm, Chamberlain Medco, Des Moines, Iowa, USA. That's sweet. So the finds. Thanks for watching, stay tuned for more videos, subscribe, it helps me out a lot, and keep on hunting the treasures out there.